Hey guys, Jacob 3 here again with my next deck review. I have reviewed these four today, and I'm now reviewing the Silver Steampunks. Um, yeah, they are made by Theory 11. If you haven't seen the original Steampunks, I can probably go dig them out at some point. Let me see. So here are the original steampunks, and here are the silvers. So the silver box, as you can see, is much more shiny. Um, yeah. So let's hop into it. I did like the original ones, the brass and copper sort of feel. Uh, that was a review from a really long time ago, so I don't really remember this deck very well. Um, I know I got the steampunks off of Fab, I believe. My dad bought them for me like a year and a half ago, two years ago, something like that. This I got for my birthday, I think, along with these five from last year. So this is an old, or a review that was, should have been out a long time ago. So the front says Bicycle Steampunk and Playing Card. It's really shiny. You can see my iPhone. Hi, iPhone. Just like the front of these, the original. The top has the grates. The grates, by the way, the whole box is embossed, just so you know, just like the original. Um, this is a U.S. Playing Card Company. You can't even read it because it's so shiny. U.S. Playing Card Company. Uh, bottom barcode, random crap, but it says, you can't even read it, distributed by Th Theory 11 right there in the corner. Top, I already went over. The back shows the back design of the cards and silver. Compare that. Um, the sides are different, actually. U.S. Playing Card Company, dis uh, produced by Theory 11, made in USA. And then U.S. Playing Card Company. So, they are generally similar. These are actually the Theory 11 ones. They have the Theory 11 logo. Um, same front and back, though. Uh, also, both of them don't have a seal. Which is nice. I always like not having seals. Trademark crap. And then just silver. Overall, I do love the aesthetics of this box. I like these ones, but I think I like this one better with the shiny silver. It looks cool. Um, ooh, those are kind of cool, actually. Uh, bicycle cards, add card, no one cares. Other side, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, Theory 11 add card. As you can see, it's like a pale gray, by the way, which I'm assuming will be most of the color way throughout this deck. Um, okay. So, Jokers, or back design, actually. Back design is just like the original, except it is in a gray, white, black, instead of... Let me find an original one to compare. So, the original... So it's definitely just... It's just basically gone black and white. It's less vibrant, of course. So that's the back design. Let me throw this back in there. I guess one of those flaps ripped off. Oops. So the Jokers, you have the one which is just kind of looks like an eye, just the turbine, looks steampunk, you know, has the U.S. Wait, it always says the U.S. and I never noticed that. So I sound really stupid when I did these other reviews and I was like, oh, there's the U.S. that you've never seen before. Never mind, and then they have the guarantee one with the same little turbine. Um, the Ace of Spades is just like the other one, as far as I remember. It's got like some serial code down there. Um, it's just ace with gears and stuff. Um, standard pips, standard everything. Otherwise, um, I believe the original Steampunk was like that too, but it does appear to have darker red, which I'm pretty sure is the same as that one. Um, and yeah, no difference in pips or anything, so I'll just leave it at that. Um, well, I guess I pulled out red ones and black ones like I usually do, but... Here are the court cards, they are, it is a shiny silver, which is nice, I don't know if you can see shininess, but uh, dark red, black, white, and silver, they are nice looking, I do like the colors, um, yeah, so overall, I mean, it's generally a bicycle deck with bicycle handling and bicycle you know, pips and court cards, but it does have custom colors, custom backs and stuff, 
custom jokers, which is nice. Of course, it is produced by Theory 11, so it's a good deck also. So let's test when am I testing dribbles. Good. Or wait, that was a spring. That was good. Dribbles. Good. Fans. Great. And the spreads. Great. This is the same as the other one, how you get that pattern. I once again don't know if you can see that I'm using my iPhone or whatever. I'm just gonna say that every single video. Um yeah, so overall, I don't know what I rated the original, but this one definitely looks nice. The box is very cool. I like the shiny silver. The box I would I would give like an eight out of ten, eight and a half out of ten. It's very nice, it's very, very shiny. You can see like my whole desk. Woo. Um the deck I would give you know, performance, it's an air cushion, it's going to perform good, but it will wear out eventually and will become poopy. So the air cushion, I mean, whatever. But overall, the deck, looks-wise, is pretty standard, but there are some custom things about it which are always nice to see. So yeah, the deck also being embossed shows the high quality, and it's by Theory 11, which also goes to show why it's embossed and high quality. Yeah. I would recommend picking this up if you have the original. If you don't have the original, pick both of them up. They are good decks. I've used the original a lot, as you can see by the beat up box. And yeah, good deck. I will see you guys next time with the club tattoo deck. Adios.